Hi children, in today's class, we are going to think about all that we know about the body. We learnt parts of the body, organ system, bones, all kinds. Now, some questions for us to recall what we learnt. Right? The first question for you is, and it's a multiple choice, and you and I together will find the answers. Okay, the first one. Which of the following is not a sense organ? Which of the following Which of the following is not as not a sense organ? So, the first option is A, ear, B, Hair, C, nose, and D option, we have tongue. Alright, now, which of the following is not a sense organ? Look at all the options I have given you. Tongue, is it a sense organ? Nose, is it a sense organ? Ear, is it a sense organ? What about hair? Yes. So, ear, nose, tongue. They are sense organs. And hair is not a sense organ. Which of the following is not a sense organ? Hair. So, that's the answer. B, hair is not a sense organ. The rest, all three are? Sense organs. Very good. The next question I have for you is, which of the following body part is called the storehouse of knowledge? That's the second question. Which of? Which of the following body parts Following body parts, which of the following body parts, parts, is called, is called the storehouse of knowledge, the Storehouse, store house of knowledge. Which of the following body part is called the storehouse of knowledge? And option A, hands, B, eyes, C, brain, and option D, nose. So, we are asked to find which of the following body parts, hands, eyes, brain, nose, all are parts of the body. Okay. But one part is called the storehouse of knowledge. Is hand storehouse? Now, eyes, nose, no. So, which is the answer? The brain. This is the storehouse of knowledge. The next question I have here is, which of the following organs of the body is protected by the skull? That's the third question. Which, which of 
the following organs following organs which are the following organs of the body of the body is protected is protected by skull okay which of the following organs of the body is protected by skull and option a stomach option b lungs option c brain and option d heart which of the following organs of the body is protected by the skull now where is the skull which part of your body head okay is the stomach is it stomach is in the skull no are the lungs in the skull no heart is in the skull no so which organ of the body is protected by the skull your brain the answer is the brain is protected by skull so that's the answer okay which of the following organ is protected by the skull your brain the next question for you is which of the following organs is not present in a body in pair pair means two so fourth question which of the following organs 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 is not present in our body in pair s not present in our body in our body in pair pair means two that's the question which of the following organ is not present in our body in pair and the options are ears option b tongue option c hands and option d kidneys pair means two so in our body which part is not pair that option that's given is ears do we have ears in pair yeah we have two ears hands is it in pair present in our body yes we have two hands kidneys yes we have two kidneys so hands kidneys ears they are all present in our body in pair so which is not b tongue we have one tongue all right so which of the following organ tongue is the organ which is not present in our body in pair next question that we i have here for you is fifth one if you have taken a shower which organ of the body part is wet which organ of the body part is wet okay 
F. If you have taken taken a shower, if you have taken a shower, which organ, which organ of your body, of your body, Which organ of your body part is wet? Part is wet. All right. Options I have here for you is lungs, B, muscles. C, D, and option D, I have here, none. Now they are asking you, which part, which organ of your body is wet when you have a shower? Now, lungs, when you have bath, are you having shower? When you have shower, does the lung get wet? No. The muscles get wet? No. None of these? No. You have another option here. Your knee of the four given, your knee is the part that will get wet. Next. The next question we have here for you is, our skin gives us the sense of, our skin, our skin gives us our skin gives us the sense of the sense of find out for yourself from the option that I'll be giving you. All right. First option A, you have taste. B option we have here is touch. Third option I have here is smell. And last option, movement. The question I have here is our skin gives us the sense of, is it taste? We are talking about skin. Is it smell? Is it movement? No. Our skin gives us the sense of touch. What is the answer? Touch. Sense of touch. Let's Read the answers I have here for you. Okay? The first question. The first question is, which, which of the following is not a sense organ? Hair is not a sense organ. Which of the following body part is called the storehouse of knowledge? Brain is the storehouse of knowledge. Which of the following organs of the body is protected by skull? Brain is protected by skull. Which of the following organs is not present in our body in pair? Tongue is not present in our body in pair. You have only one tongue. If you have taken a shower, which organ of the body part is wet? You have been given three, four options. Knee is the part that will be wet. Finally, our skin gives us the sense of touch. 